Hello, people, and uh, my topic is going to be right this week is that uh, recently I'm getting some very bizarre or some someone would call it very unexplainable dreams, and uh, here to 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 uh, to speak on behalf of that is myself, and uh, I think in most of the, my dreams it, it's kind of a telltale sign that uh, it maybe something is going to happen. And the only thing is that I will talk about the last three days of the dreams if it's seen anything significant. Now, I know the dream that I have with the cheerleader and LeBron James was quite an amazing story. I've been getting a lot more basketball dreams than anything. Um, I, because, uh, you know, I've been a big fan of it for almost uh, so many years, going back to Jordan and Michael and Magic. But LeBron James was a weird, interesting thing because when I dunk landed him, I wore, um, I believe, uh, was the Miami Heat jersey, and I made all the slam, the, all the uh, dunks, the spin, and then drive in the lane. And the one that was the scariest one is I dunked over an old man. I almost fell on myself. But the sweetest part is that when I won the championship, very, very. Oh, sexy cheerleader, you know what the cheerleaders look like. Headed me the trophy. How sweet is that? Now, I had another dream, which yesterday I dreamt that, um, I remember that kangaroos was having sex, having intercourse. Wow, that, it's, that is so bizarre. It was something that, I, I don't know, it's, uh, while, while at it, they were, uh, Baby kangaroos was on the way. It was like, okay, I saw them doing their stuff, and then later on, uh, baby kangaroos were getting more born. Uh, then, I don't know if that, that explains anything, but then another dream I had was the other night. Um, I'm trying to think of all the dreams I had. I mean, there there's been some really, oh, that I was uh, in a bus with my dad. And I believe this girl was, I'm not sure, Hispanic or Caucasian. And I sat not too far from her. She was probably ahead of me. And, I, you know, all the years I've sat on the bus, I've never, we never break the ice. Like, oh, yeah, yeah it's very hard to have no girls like that. Um, we sat, and I didn't talk to her. She didn't talk to me. But it was weird that later on I dated her. And we're, we're holding hands, and it might have been somebody I know. You see, now speaking of somebody I know, I've been talking about this dream on my Facebook uh, uh, pages, uh, Asian love addiction course over there. I'm not gonna name names, but she was talking about what a, what kind of dreams I've been having. It's been really strange. I I admit it. I have some very really strange dreams lately. So. Um, you know, it is something I can't explain. It's just maybe, and she was telling me if it was yoga related. I, I, I don't know. I don't know what is being really. Every did power workouts. I've been doing exercise lately. So I don't know. It's just, it's just been a lot of stuff going on. Maybe um, I don't think yoga, because I do medit, not meditate like a deep meditator would do. So yeah, I'm just trying to. Try to see what explained my dreams, but I had dreams before, even going to last year. Sometimes not so funny, not so pleasant, um, but nothing beat the be good cheerleader, and nothing beat a slam dunk. And uh, I have to say, um, you know, that's one of the best dreams right there. Until next time.